maybe the biggest thing that's changed in the last five years is me realizing, wow, I don't know anything yet. There's so much to go, and there's so far to go. And, and wow, at the same time, look what has happened. Uh, I'm, I know I'm happier now, and, and, and I feel smarter and better, but I still know I'm a dunce in the grand scheme of things, an idiot. And there's so far to, to, to go, so I'm just, I'm, just, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a, a person on a mission. So I don't know if I'm, I'm different, I'm just more. I'm just continuing, and uh, the mission is to, uh, to do good stuff while we're around here and to try to make other people feel psyched. And uh, so far that mission is going well. It's been about five years in the making. I've, I've played piano my whole life, I've been in bands and things, but about five years ago is when I said, I gotta work on something hard, I gotta do something every day. And, uh, and, and what's the best thing I could do except uh, try to make the sound of, of a rhythm that just takes you to anywhere you want to go, you know what I mean? And just make the most thrilling, huge, gargantuan, colossal, glorious, triumphant music over and over and over and over and over in a billion and then just, and just do it. Oh wow, who knows, that's the thing. Like. Three months ago, you could ask me what we would have been, what I would have been thinking or doing, you know, today, and and I would never have been been there. It's it's really it's like warp speed right now, and uh, I'm hoping that uh, in the in the big picture we just continue, we just continue, and and this past six months, in fact, has has been a, a lot of a lot of great things happening to prove to ourselves, uh, and I have proven to ourselves and others that that this will not stop. Um, so that's the one thing I can guarantee is that in five years, unless some horrible circumstance happens, knock on wood, knock on fibered wood, wear some pure fibered wood. Okay, pardon me. <laughs> <sighs> so knock on wood, uh, we will be going and going and going and going. I know you're young. When were you younger? What was the favorite show you going to see live? Oh, concert? Yeah. Several Probably, years. well, no, there's, there's definitely some defining, some really defining ones. I was about uh, 14, probably. No, no, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. 14 or 15. Um, I went to see a concert by a band called Scheme in this garage building in this parking lot of, of, of a, an, a different concert place that was for folk music. And this was in the parking lot. And this band is weird and wild and, and real far out. And uh, it really blew my mind and changed the way I thought and, and introduced me things to, uh, to things I'd never conceived of before. Just like if you were a, 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 a fish living in a, in a, in a fishbowl and this is what you knew as reality. You know, you, yeah. This was all you could possibly know. Someone pulled you out of that fishbowl and, 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 and showed, put you into a big, huge ocean. You know, then it's like, wow. So that's, that's what it seemed like. And that was about you know, 10 years ago. Well, actually, what's your, uh, what's your favorite place that you've played? I mean, I know you've played a lot of places. Yeah. Um, Anyone's there's not one right favorite. Now. There's just been some amazing, uh, some amazing, uh, some amazing concerts. One of the first, earliest concerts I ever played, um, right? Meaning, not with a band in general, but with this, because this this was different. This is where I said I'm not gonna even worry about having a band at first. I just I'm just gonna, you know, start making these songs. And if, if I gotta play them by myself, I will. I, I wasn't happy with that, but I did do a lot of concerts by myself. And one of the first ones was in uh, in Belgium, where I got invited, kind of as a fluke. Um, these other guys got invited, but they couldn't do it, so they passed it on to me. And, uh, and we were, I was very lucky to get the opportunity at all. And um, what ended up happening was, 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 was totally insane, because this one dude, just me, shows up at this really big arts festival with all these musicians and all these really famous artists doing all these huge productions and concerts and, and, and art pieces like all over the city and they said okay well you're, you're gonna play in the town square so they took me to the town square and on top of it like a huge big like cathedral like building with 5,000 people standing in front for the first time ever even knowing that I existed I sang at this ridiculous sounding screaming as loud as I could basically while these really fast early versions of these songs just went ding 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 and uh, after a song would finish, there'd be kind of silence, and then like a... <laughs> 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 and it was wild, and it was, it, was, it was like, be on the roof of this building, I could have fallen right off. The whole thing was just so intense. Um, 
and I've never really had an experience like that again where everything is happening so fast and it's, the, it's, it's wild. Maybe the show where you were like, yeah, this is finally going to work? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, and I knew, even not by their response, but I knew already by that point um, that, that I was going to be able to do this. That I, was gonna, I knew I was always going to be able to do it. I just didn't know what was going to happen. And um, I still don't know what's going to happen, but everything that's happened so far, I'm incredibly thankful for, and it still amazes me. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll watch a concert <laughs> of ours and be like, this is the... What is what is going on here? Like this is, wow! This is weird. You know it's what I mean? It's pretty intense. I haven't seen anything quite like that. I mean, I grew up. It is what it is. When I saw a lot of shows, and they were big shows, and it's the crowd just, this hasn't is, been this good in a long time that I've seen. Good. Well, I, I mean, it's just it's it's um it's something that we decide that we're just focused on now, and uh, it, now it exists. Now yeah. now we're doing it. Now all these people are involved, and we're all in it together. And with that kind of power, that kind of strength of all of these friends, all believing in this, there's no telling what we can do. So we're all in it together. Was there a time when you saw a shift? I mean, like, you know, every time I've seen like a hundred kids rush the stage. I mean, everybody yeah. wants to get up there. I mean, when you first started playing, was that happening as much? Or was no, just, no, no. Was there just a show where just, holy shit, everybody's on stage with me? Well, there, it, there's things that started happening here and there um, where, where when someone did, you know, because occasionally someone always would jump on the stage at a concert. But the difference was when they did with us, we didn't want them to leave necessarily right away. We wanted them to have a second to do, to do their dance, maybe sing a few lines, maybe you know do a kick and then and then jump off or do whatever. And so uh, that kind of thing, I guess, just spread around and people people said, hey, you know, I guess you can all dance on stage. And then there was a big concert, uh, at, at sort of a turning point that I remember in Birmingham, Alabama, um, where we played as part of this, you know, all-day concert event. With, yeah, yeah, with lots of bands. And uh, it was near the end of the night, and uh, I had no idea what to expect. And I would have been completely unsurprised if we had been booed, you know what I mean, even. This was this was, this was a while ago, and, and uh, I, w I was not nervous, just on fire determined to, like, throw down as hard as humanly possible and, and, and that's all we ever do and that's that's a great situation to be in to have the opportunity to prove to someone who maybe hasn't seen you so anyway I didn't know what to expect we kicked in and within the first half of the first song I think the stage was already starting to get filled with people and then by the end the whole thing was and I had heard like as we were walking to the stage there was all these people coming up going oh my like telling me how they've been waiting for this concert and and I was like, oh my God, there's something happening here. I started feeling this tingling feeling, but like this show might be amazing. And then uh, I still didn't know what was going to happen, though. And, but then the minute it kicked in, it was just mayhem. And it, it was one of the most amazing experiences I've ever had in any, in any capacity, um, not only just in concerts. And uh, it was incredibly moving, and it, it gave me such confidence and certainty, not in myself alone or in what we had, but in that people like to feel good, that this is not just a fluke, you know what I mean? That look at all these people, all different kinds of people, and not and the people people that I never in a million years would have predicted or expected to like this music, and to see them with a look in their eyes of complete abandon, of complete freedom, of complete confidence, that there's, there's no uncertainty, there's no, there's no uh, self, so, uh, self consciousness, or, consciousness or insecurity about, about what they're doing, they're completely free and 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 to see that and to to be a part of it not even to cause it because everyone decides on their own to do, to do that i can't tell someone to do that they have to d decide for themselves so for me to just be another part person am, am, amongst that energy is is uh unreal is unreal I, there's no way to describe it there's, there's 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 just no way you just know you just there's no way to communicate it. and it's not because it's not because i think everybody gets to feel that in their life but there's a reason you can't describe it. You only can you can only feel it, and sometimes that's, those are the best feelings in the world. Hi, this is Andrew WK, and I want to make sure that all you guys out there hop on your computers and type in http colon forward slash forward slash www.seriesdvd.com. Hi, this is Andrew WK. I want to make sure all you guys out there go onto your computers and type in http colon forward slash forward slash www. What is it again?